you guys are looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now, make sure to check out my brand new sponsor, MMO EXP. They have the cheapest coins that you can find anywhere on the internet. Use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we just got a nice early Mutt Leaks leaked right now. Now, guys, we haven't gotten a Mutt Leak in what feels like a year. Now, it's probably been a few months, but in reality, guys, I feel like this guy is selling off the face of the earth. But we get a nice early 8 a.m. Mutt Leak. Now, I was asleep for this, and so was Zerk. We're both up now, but kind of upsetting that they did it this early. Now, again, most of you guys are sleeping anyways, too, so more than makes up for it. But, guys, they did just leak pretty much every promo for the year of Madden. Now, things could change. EA could scratch some. EA could add some. But this is a pretty good foundation for the promos that they do have planned for the rest of the year. As well as, guys, the EA access uh, date was confirmed, and it's not the 21st, apparently. I will show you guys that. As well as be ready, all the Madden 21 Ultimate Team use is being revealed today. We're going to get into all that, but guys, before we get into the video, make sure to below, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, boys, and join the family. Get that notification bell on, guys. You don't want to miss all these Madden, all this Madden news, all these Madden leaks, and eventually actual Madden 21 content. And sa smash the like button. Can we get 100 likes, guys, on this massive leak? Guys, can we get 100 likes for the first time in months? It'll be pretty awesome. And it'll be a nice way to start kicking off the year for Madden 21. Now, going into this, guys, let's come over here to the actual Mutt leak. So, Mutt Leak right here, it shows you Mutt 21 program list based on reveal assets subject to change. So, we got Mutt Card Journey. So, that's the journey we got in the game, of course. Gauntlet, Heavyweight. We got Veterans and Flashback. So, so far, guys, this is all standard. Nothing too exciting yet. We got Captains, which we expect. We always have Captains. Then, we got Campus Heroes. Now, this is one of the most exciting ones right here. So, I'm going to take a second to talk about this one. So, I have the vlog open, guys. Campus Heroes is always one of the more fun, exciting promos. We haven't done it. And what feels like a long time. This is back in 2017. Now, I don't I know I haven't done it in at least two years of Madden. So campus heroes are pretty much guys who did really good in college. Like they were heroes on their campus. They did really good in their college team. They may not even and they may not even perform in the NFL, like Josh Jackson, Geno Smith, Carl Nassib. Three guys that are nothing special in the NFL, but they were really good in college, like a Matt Barkley type, uh, Reggie Bush. Uh there's, there's guys, there's just so there's so many. Jarvis Landry, uh, Odell, of course, Tillich, Terrence Williams, Ronnie Stanley. Uh, let's see, we got Robert Griffin was a really cool one. Tim Tebow, Reggie Ragland, Tyron Matthew. Campus Heroes is so cool because it's almost like an NCAA promo without being one. Like you get like if you especially if you're a college fan, because right? if you were a college fan, you may have thought more highly of Tim Tebow and Geno Smith. And Tyron Matthew, and maybe you even did when they got to the NFL because you were a college fan. You know, they, they were they were legends in your town or your, you know, the college you're from. So that's super cool, especially for a lot of people who are big college football fans or people who are just football fans that know players like Robert Griffin who never met their potential because of an injury. They went down early, but you get to play with him as a campus hero and he gets that the stats of what he was back when he was that age. Versus, you know, they make a they make a RG3 usually, they don't give him the high speed anymore because he's a bit older and he doesn't need to he got hurt and whatever. It's kinda stupid. They give him a campus here. They're giving him high speed because that was his prime Baylor card. Campus here is super cool. But let's get back on to the leaks and go back over some of the other stuff. Now, guys, campus here is one with that drop. I believe that would drop probably based on overalls. I would say has to drop around. I mean, if it goes by 94 overalls, it would probably drop around like November, December. But I feel like it's more of a January promo, if anything. But that's team of the year and stuff. So I really don't know when this usually drops. See, because it says April here. But 94 overalls are way too late for April. And they're pretty good at making sure overalls match up nowadays. So, I mean, it could be April, but that's based on overall. Now, if we're going to go for us, I'd say they should save it to, like, March, April, and then make them 97, 98s. That's just my opinion. But let's get it over back to the league. So, next we got uh, Signature Series. Again, some go with Zev. Team of the Week, low cards. Team of the Week, high cards. Something we always have. Team Builder, low. Team Builder, high. That is new, I believe. No, no that's Team Diamonds. Team Builders, we always have. Team Diamond low, Team Diamond high. Now, Team Diamonds are super cool because that does pretty much mean we'll have 32 Team Diamond cards to start the year off. Back in Madden 19, one of them I really liked was uh, Jalen Ramsey, one of my favorite ones, of course. That one was super great, super expensive, and it gives, you, it gives your cards a lot of value, especially your base elites for early in the year, which will help with value of cards. Rising Stars low, Rising Stars high. Um, I believe those were those like rookie card things that were like... I don't remember the exact specifics of it, but... It's been around before. Muck card legends, muck card legends high, muck card legends low. That just means the low of set legends and then the um the set the set the set master. We got muck core silver, of course, muck core rookie, of course, power up, gold, 
platinum cards, which is great. Those are returning, which is good for level of prospects in terms of the uh, level of packs. We got the campaign story, um, which I believe is just those really bad solo challenges. We got low elites, high elites. Okay, that's standard. We got Mutt Master Low, Mutt Master High. I guess that's no Core Master. What card Core Master? I really don't know what that means. And then we got Series 7, Series 6, Series 5, Series 4, Series 3, Series 2, Series 1. So we're supposed to get 7 series this year, which is one more than last year, I'm pretty sure, which does kind of confirm that they did cut a series out for lack of time. So first series is going to be pink, then blue, then yellow, then green, then orange, and aqua, then red. You guys know what that means? It's pretty much just like the colors of uh, like the series. So, like, your trophies or like whatever you got in the corner typically are this color. And maybe even the Muck Card Master will have some background related to this. But this kind of wraps up the whole League of Aldi promo. So let's see what we got here. We definitely got more than this. I think this is just some that they have in here because obviously the Christmas promo is not in there. I guess these are just like the uh, the side promos they're doing because obviously we have the seasonal promos like Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Um, ooh, I'm blanking here. But you guys get the point. Now, I'm hoping they do add a few other things. I do want to see a Blockbuster promo. I haven't had that in a few years. Blockbuster promo would be great. Do you want to see Positional Heroes make a return? This might just be what they're working with for the first few months, in my opinion. This is like their, their base stuff that they're doing before. Maybe even before like... This might just be up until December, not including seasonal, which would be great. There's a lot of content if we're not including seasonal, and this is all the way up to December. And then after that, we have a whole other list, which would be really cool. Um, again, can't count on that too much because again, we have had leaks in the past and they always pan out. But we can only hope at this point. Next, I just want to show you this real quick. So Madden 21 was officially originally scheduled to be released, but appeared to be August 21st. And the thing with that is every year we get given a date, and somehow it's never the exact date. So. Last year, it was the 26th, 25th, and we ended up getting it on the 24th. So we were super confused. This year was 21st. Mudhead said the 21st. EA said the 21st. Literally everyone and their mother said the 21st. So we actually thought it might be confirmed. And then someone went into Madden 21 Origins, uh, the, pre the preload thing, which is like where you download the EA Access version, you just wait for it to actually play it. Or you download the game and you wait for it to, allow, about, to be playable. Preload is now available. Origins Access Premiere release date, August 20th at 11 a.m. So it's saying August 20th now, which is indeed two days from just about now. And the thing is with that is that, yes, there's been some issues. It might even be an hour late at that point because it might, might glitch out, servers might crash. But it's not. it doesn't appear to be August 21st. Now, I really wish I did know the exact day so I could plan some things right now because I had, to, I had to, I was to change my internet service provider and it was the 20th. They were coming the 20th at 11 o'clock, so I had to just change that. It would really suck if they ended up coming the 21st and then I could have kept it the 20th. But... Have to wait to see you guys, but that's about it for the video. Guys, all Madden 21 news will be coming today at 6.30 p.m. Make sure to check the stream out. Uh, Jake Stein, Kralo, and the guys will be there. You're going to be going over the, everything in the game, pretty much the Mutt Masters, Team Captains, everything you can do, guys. Everything you want to know about Madden Ultimate Team is going to come today, so make sure to check out that stream, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on the new boys. Give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get 100 likes, guys? Thank you for watching. I'm out. Peace.